Internal Revenue Service IRS Tax News. IRS begins new digital intake initiative form 940 scanning process off to strong start. Other forms to start soon. New digital intake? Yeah, I knew it. They're after my Bitcoin again. Oops. I shouldn't have aired my suspicions like that. Phil, Phil, cut that part out. Otherwise, our podcast is at risk. Now, you know how dead set the government is against allowing free speech and information flow. You know, they're, they're likely to boldly shut down our God-given natural right to free speech and association directly from the Senate floor itself for crying out loud. Just like they did with that January 6th footage thing. I urge Fox News to order Carlson to cease propagating the big lie on his network. No, oh, okay, Phil. It's just because the footage was cherry-picked, right? By diving deep into the waters of conspiracy and cherry-picking. So, so let me, let me get this straight. Ch- Chuck Schumer is accusing other people of cherry-picking the footage that they themselves could have released any time over the last two years, but intentionally and deliberately decided not to because it wasn't helpful to their narrative of democracy dies in darkness i mean honestly phil that's like that's like saying like lebron james sitting under the basketball hoop for 10 minutes while action is going on on the other side of the court then catching a lob throwing the entire distance of the court and then like pointing to to stephen curry or something as he's dunking the ball calling the other guy the cherry picker in this situation i mean it's it's kind of ridiculous i mean As one of the referees in this democracy, I must call the person withholding the footage for over two years, painting an incomplete picture and creating a narrative that they were like Honest Abe or something, is the cherry picker, not the person adding pieces to the puzzle. You know, stop stop trying to flop on the ground to draw fouls, Schumer. I mean, it's, it's, it's embarrassing. You're embarrassing yourself. So many others who were here in the Capitol and millions and millions of Americans are just furious. It's ridiculous. Because, like, the new puzzle pieces reveal a slightly different picture. One showing the government not only cherry-picking or even simply cutting down the cherry tree and lying about it. The picture seems to show the government mowing down cherry trees with, like, one of those cutting machines in Dr. Seuss's The Lorax, while pointing to the nearest bystander to blame for the property destruction. Yeah, okay, Phil, I know, I know. I know we're banned from saying Dr. Seuss. Just, just cut it out, I guess. Cut that part out. Anyways, I'm telling you, these people, I'm afraid, are no honest Abe. Therefore... I call for renewed strengthening of the government checks and restoration of the government balances. Last night, millions of Americans tuned in to one of the most shameful hours we have ever seen on cable television. Honestly, has this guy ever even seen like a reality TV show? Like possibly one of those old like Jerry Springer shows where they're fighting on stage or something like that? I mean... IR 2023-41, March 8th, 2023, Washington. As part of ongoing transformation efforts, the Internal Revenue Service announced today the successful expansion of digital scanning and a major step in the new digital intake scanning initiative. The IRS has already scanned more than 120,000 paper form 940 since the start of 2023. This is a 20-fold increase compared to all of 2022. I think that's kind of a split sentence or a run-on sentence right there. Shouldn't that be like a period? And then like this is a 20-fold increase because that's like a, this could stand alone, not as a fragment, but at, I mean, I'm not an, I've been practicing my English. I'm not, maybe I'm wrong on that, but I feel like that should be a separate sentence. But in any case, this effort will expand soon uh, to include scanning of Form 1040 as well as Form 941. The scanning effort is part of a multi-form, multi-solution scanning initiative known as Digital Intake. Quote, this expansion of scanning is another milestone for the IRS as we work to transform the agency, end quote, said acting IRS Commissioner Doug O'Donnell. Quote, 
We anticipate expanding scanning of more paper returns in the near future, saving time and creating efficiencies for taxpayers, the business community, as well as tax professionals and the IRS. That's a lot of helping, a lot of people improved situations there. Digital scanning is part of a larger effort underway at the IRS to transform the agency and make improvements for taxpayers as part of the Inflation Reduction Act. Oh my goodness. It's the Inflation Reduction Act. I knew it. They're saving, they're making inflation go down by lessening the paper distribution. uh, And maybe some of that paper is like money that they're printing or something. So they'll somehow that will decrease the inflation or something maybe i don't know i wish they'd tell us how this stuff is linked to the inflation because we read we read about this inflation reduction act like all the time over here at the irs news and they i never see it linked to like reducing inflation which is always the first thing that comes to mind when i hear the the title but in any case the irs has taken steps to improve service including hiring more than five thousand new telephone assisters will that reduce inflation Adding staff to IRS taxpayer assistance centers. Huh, does that reduce inflation? And holding special Saturday hours. I don't think that would reduce inflation at all. Expanding the document upload tool and other features. Okay, but how does that inflation doesn't do, I don't see any linkage, the, the linkage is missing. The IRS has been using various technologies to scan tax returns for more than 35 years, but recently took a leap forward by leveraging cutting-edge technologies via revolutionary uh, pr- um, procurement approach <laughs> to test their effectiveness. The capabilities enable the IRS to digitalize more paper for downstream processing and storage, resulting in greater efficiencies and improved data management outcomes. Now, I would assume that these are types of things that businesses have been doing for some time. And I I am, I do think it's a good thing that the IRS updates their systems over there and starts to get into the modern age and whatnot. (laughs) So that is a good thing. I I wish they wouldn't fund it through a bill called Inflation Reduction Act, just outright lying to people about the bill. But, you know, at least (laughs) hopefully they spend some of that money Uh, improving things. So in addition to contracts with industry partners, the IRS is also working with Treasury Bureau of the Fiscal Service and Lockbox Financial Agent to expand the reach of this work. Current scanning initiatives currently underway at the IRS cover digital intake with Lockbox. Lockbox Financial Agents FAs are banks that specialize in payment processing, but until now have not taken the extra step to scan and process tax forms. Each year, millions of taxpayers send payments and associated tax forms to these lockbox banks. The lockbox project works to scan paper returns on site and e-file those returns. All right, that went a little bit over my head, but it sounds like it could be good. Digital intake with industry partners. I like work with the lockbox financial agents. This process extracts machine uh, readable information from paper tax returns and then e-files those returns. So these efforts with industry partners via contracts issued the IRS allow the IRS to process forms that are received directly by the IRS. So possibly they can take some of their paper forms and, and convert them to digital format, I believe is the idea there, which sounds like a good idea, however, you would think that the paper forms they're trying to they're trying to remove the paper forms altogether so it seems like if they're paying a lot of money to convert paper forms to digital format when the digital paper forms will probably be non-existent at some time that's kind of a uh, a question in terms of how long uh, a benefit that kind of thing will be but in any case Quote, we are making significant progress in this effort, and we look to expand scanning efforts dramatically in months ahead and working toward a fully digital future, end quote, said Enterprise Digitalization and Case Management Office co-director Harrison Smith. Quite the title. Quite the title. It takes almost an entire line. You know that dude's important because his title's like a whole line almost. Quote, 
we're building a foundation that will enable us to help uh, taxpayers and businesses for years to come, end quote. The vast majority of tax returns are now filed electronically, but millions of forms are still filed by paper, which means a time-consuming process of manually handling and transcribing of these tax returns by providing a capability to scan and electronically process paper returns. The IRS will be able to shorten the processing time for taxpayers who, who file paper returns. That's great. Maybe you could start answering the phone now. Now that we spent all this money with a bill called the Inflation Reduction Act that we took all the money and spent it on all this other stuff, which was a total lie, it seems like, then maybe you can, like, answer the phone. Now that we gave you all that money, could you just, like, answer the phone when we call sometimes? We're kind of, in any case, quote, Technology powers tax administration, and we have completed important work over the last year to help people get the assistance they need and reduce paper in addition to improving the agency's underlying technology infrastructure. Wow, those are a lot of big words. End quote said IRS Chief Information Officer Nancy Seeger. So I don't know. I don't know what they just said right there, but I'm impressed by the vocabulary. So I'm sure it's going to be in a benefit. It's got to be worth all that money. Quote, this is another positive step in the future technology direction for the IRS that includes improving service to taxpayers. End quote. Well, I don't know. There, but there's a link. There's links to some of that stuff here. So you can look into it a bit more. I'm glad they're kind of updating the thing. They're spending the money. You know, I'd rather they spend it up on that rather than like some, some shell game like you know, energy power company that's not even an energy power company or something that goes under because of whatever. But I don't know. You could check it out here. There'll be a link to this in the description.